This video describes the track and intensity use case that involves the TCNPR Tropical Cyclone Matched Pair Plotter. Before you proceed, make sure you have run the tutorial from Session 5, TC Pairs Tool, and have saved all corresponding output. The TCMPR plotter wraps the plot underscore TCMPR.R file. This is the R plotting script that is part of your MET installation. If you want to familiarize yourself with plot underscore tcmpr.r, refer to the TC stat tool example in the MET user's guide. If you haven't already done so, you can also follow session 5 of the tutorial. Track and int feature relative met tool TC stat. This TCMPR plotter use case uses output from the met TC pairs tool. You can refer to section 20.2.3 of the met users guide for a description of the TC pairs output format. The TCMPR plotter wrapper makes use of three configuration files. In addition to the other default MetPlus configuration files described in session one, MetPlus setup directories and configurations files. These configuration files are TCMPR plotter config customize, TCMPR plotter.conf, and track and intensity output.conf. You will create the track and intensity output.conf as it is your custom config file. The TCMPR plotter config customize file is used by METS R script that generates the plot and is used to set attributes of the plot. The tcmprplotter.conf file is a default configuration file that encapsulates common settings. It is located in the PARM use cases Met tool wrapper TCMPR plotter directory of your MetPlus source code. You can override these values that are defined in the TCMPR plotter.conf file by redefining these in the custom config file track and intensity output.conf. The settings in the tcmprplotter.conf file and track and intensity .output.conf file are used by the MetPlus wrapper to run METS R plotting script. Before we proceed, let's look at the tcmpr plotter config customize file, which is used by the R script to set plot attributes. When you open the file, you can see that it has only one key value setting, image res equals 72. This value dictates the image size of the plot that is created. 
If this value is left unset, that is, set to nothing, the R script plot underscore tcmpr dot R will use the default value of 300. This value results in an extremely large plot in your display. The default value is also used if this configuration file is omitted or non-existent. Let's begin by setting up the use case. For the next steps, make sure you are working out of the MetPlus tutorial directory. Create a unique output directory where you want to save the use case output files. Open the custom configuration file called trackandintensity.output.conf and set the output base value with the path to the output directory you just created. Now set the input base to the full path corresponding to the output directory from the TC Pairs tool tutorial. This is the directory that contains your TC Pairs.txt file. Remember to close the file. You can take a moment to look at what is defined in the PARM, Use Cases, MetTool Wrapper, TCMPR Plotter, tcmprplotter.com file. And under the config section. Sections are indicated with the section name surrounded by square brackets. The plotting sections of interest settings of interest will begin with TCMPR plotter followed by a descriptive name. Unassigned settings under the config section will use default values that are established in the plot TCMPR script. For example, TCMPR plotter title sets the title of the plot. If left unassigned, a default title is created. The settings from the default and configuration files will allow you to generate a box plot and plots of the mean and median for the A and B track MSLP, the A and B track maximum win, and the track errors. Let's go to example one. Now you are ready to run the track and intensity use case. We will read in the .tcst files as input to the plot underscore tcmpr.r script and create static, static image files with a .png extension. From the command line, run the master underscore metplus.py command that you see in this dark gray box. You should observe the following output in the output directory you created. The plot file names are comprised of the dependent variable name from the TCMPR plotter depth var setting and the plot type from the TCMPR plotter plot type setting. You can use the display command to view these .png files. Here is an example of how to use the display command.
In the previous example, we generated box plots, mean, and median plots. Now, let's just create box plots of the variables of interest. Open your track and intensity.output.con file and set TCMPR plotter plot types equal to box plot. Close the file and rerun the master underscore metplus.py command from the command line. Now look at your output files in your output directory. Now you should see that only box plots were generated. Again, use the display command to view the plots. This concludes the track and intensity TCMPR plotter use case. Now it's your turn to do more experimentation with the configuration files. Thank you for your time and attention.